So it's Dayan aka Venom I Shooter back at it with another video and yeah as you guys saw I was in fact in Cape Town I uh, managed to stop into quite a few stores went to check out the exclusive books at the v &A waterfront which was amazing highly recommend checking it out if you haven't but yeah other than that stopped in at the usual toy stores stuff like that see what they had um, for the most part it was kind of bare um, they did have some of the newer Funko exclusives and stuff in. Um, aside from that, they had some Mo2 Masterverse figures, which was kind of cool seeing. Not too much at uh, Hamleys, which I did stop in, didn't get any footage there. But then I also stopped in at Toy Kingdom and you saw quite a bit of that footage. It was nice going into um, Toy Kingdom, they had quite a bit of stuff, the Lego. They had a lot of the bigger sets. Only problem was, once again, not enough space to take it back with me. But yeah, other than that, I uh, stopped in at two of the coolest stores in Cape Town. And I highly recommend you check it out if you're ever in Cape Town. One being uh, Gaming and Chill Lounge and two being Reader's Den. So starting off with Reader's Den, it's your typical kind of comic book store, has your graphic novels, some single issues, uh, quite a decent manga section to be honest, like I was quite impressed, I had quite a bit of Soul Eater, uh, stuff you don't really see too often. Um, yeah some of your spicier content which was kind of cool seeing and honestly the pricing was a lot better than a lot of your typical bookstores which was quite nice which is why i ended up picking up the demon slayer one shot and yeah there actually is a second one this is just the stories of water and fire which is a rengoku uh gyu tomioka story um actually read this on the plane on my way back really fun read um it was nice that we got some new demon sale content but yeah uh, actually it would be pretty cool if they ended up animating these even if it's just like filler episodes in uh, season three or something but yeah uh, next up headed over to gaming and chill lounge it was 
incredible the gaming stations looked so dope um the people there were so friendly and yeah their stuff is on take a lot and i'll leave the link in the description um so you guys can go check it out and yeah uh although the price is in store is slightly reduced uh, because take a lot does have a bit of a markup so if you are interested in getting these at a deal i'd highly recommend going in checking out gaming and chill lounge maybe picking up some stuff and yeah starting things off i picked up the star wars black series mandalorian from season one this is his first suit in the show um with the battle damage suit and stuff and yeah really glad to have him i am a pretty big star wars fan i do like quite a bit of star wars stuff uh, i do have quite a bit of star wars stuff in my collection as well but yeah moving on picked up a baby Grogu figure, Baby Yoda, Grogu, whatever you want to call him, but this is so cute and I think he's going to play so well with uh, the Mandalorian, so yeah, really glad to have those. Then got in a package from Take A Lot and I got back and finally managed to find a spider-man ben riley figure from the retro carded wave this thing came in a really great packaging um that had a protective like sleeve over it um it was a soft plastic sleeve kind of like what you'd expect on some of the stores that sell the manga those kind of sleeves as well as like your comic books and stuff like that but honestly i think it did the job corners are fine uh no chunks missing <laughs> of the box uh, the um, bubble itself is pretty much scratch uh, proof like I think that was really smart idea to package it like that and yeah really glad to finally have it I'm only missing one more that said though I have seen the Hasbro 2 pack with Carnage and uh, Black Suit Spidey in the retro carded uh, kind of vintage cassette kind of packaging and honestly I am a big fan of the animated series blue and black kind of Spidey uh, shaded deco so maybe I'll pick that one up instead but yeah it just depends on what I see first but yeah thank you guys for watching as always I'll catch you guys in the next one cheers